for the CAD Geek. I'm Donnie Gladfelt here. And in this video, I'm going to share with you a super simple way to manage the appearance of different types of dimensions. So let's say linear versus radial dimensions within your AutoCAD drawings. Now the problem comes into play here, especially when I use things like the architectural tick, because when I add it to this drawing, it looks great if what I'm adding is a linear dimension. But the moment I come over here and I add the dimension for this curved wall, while AutoCAD adds the dimension in, I probably want something more like an arrow in lieu of the architectural tick for that dimension. So what I find a lot of people will do is create an entirely new dimension style, one that uses arrows instead of architectural ticks, and they'll go ahead and change the entire dimension style to get the result that they want. Now, in lieu of doing that, a better way to approach this is by configuring what are known as child dimension styles. So if I switch over to the annotate tab inside of AutoCAD, I'm going to go ahead and open up the dimension style uh, manager here. And what I'm going to do is pick on my parent uh, dimension style in this case, which is architecture. Now I'm going to go ahead and choose new. And what I'm going to do, I'm not going to really type in a name up here, but notice down here, I have this use for, and if I use this drop down list, notice I can choose any of the different types of dimensions that I can create inside of AutoCAD. So for instance, if I wanted radial dimensions to look different from all other dimensions, I'll just go ahead and pick radius dimension right here. I'll say continue. And this is going to open up the dimension style dialog. Now the great thing is I can come in here and change things like the arrowhead to closed filled and click OK, and this will only apply to radial dimensions. Notice what's happened here. Underneath the architectural style, the radial style appears right underneath of that. So now, keeping the architectural style current, if I come over here and choose dimension, and I pick on this curved wall once again, placing that dimension, notice I now get an arrowhead, even though I'm still using the architectural dimension style. It automatically knew that this was a radial dimension and it applied the child style. So there you have it, just a very quick and easy tip for managing the appearance of your dimensions inside of AutoCAD. For the CAD Geek, I'm Donnie Gladfelter. Thanks for watching.